Hello everybody, Sanyer, Engineer, MBA and Investor and in today's video I want to talk about Elon Musk tweeting about CRISPR for the first time ever. He has now responded to a topic that directly relates to CRISPR and that is done of course in front of the screen here where we have Cathy Woods tweeting out the following. Last month, BBC reported that GOSH, a research hospital in UK base, edited a genome of 12 year old girl, Elisa, suffering from leukemia. She had failed dozen therapies and had no more options. Seven months later, she is cancer free. Not many investors know about it. The bear market last year, uh, the bear market last year suffocated this news, even though it made splash at ASH. In our view, US equity markets today are 180 degrees away from the tech and telecom bubble in the late 90s. Unlike the case then, the technologies are ready and the costs are low enough for prime time. Investors changed the dream then and now they're running away. And of course, Elon Musk goes on by tweeting, wow. So this is the tweet, guys. Elon Musk tweeting, wow, is the tweet. And it's getting lots of views, lots of traction by the biotech community. And I mean, this was bound to happen. I mean, it was bound to happen. It was bound for Elon Musk to get involved in this space somehow. I mean, he did tweet last year about genome editing as a whole. Um, but of course, CRISPR is not the only form of genome editing. There could be other uh, you know, terminology that could sort of be used when it comes to genome editing. It's just one of the tools. And in my opinion, it is the most useful and most popular tool CRISPR as it is when it comes to genome editing. But of course, genome editing could be a whole, you know, sphere of tools, right? It's like a toolkit where you call the toolkit genome editing and bunch of tools within the toolkit could be different technologies. CRISPR is one of them, right? So Elon tweeting, wow, I mean, I know it's just one word, but it's pretty, pretty, pretty darn impressive that we're in 2023, we still don't have any FDA approved CRISPR drug. And now we have, you know, arguably the most influential personal person in the world in the last like three years, I would say, uh, tweeting about, you know, tweeting back about CRISPR, right? And of course, he didn't mention CRISPR, he didn't, you know, give his take, he didn't say he's investing, it's none of that, right? But the fact that he's giving exposure to this tweet from Kathy Wood, and shout out to Kathy Wood for tweeting this out. Um, you know, we all know Arik Invest has done an amazing job in the CRISPR space. And this is one of the examples where they were able to use their popularity, their reputation, uh, and expose information that, you know, most investors are not aware of. And I 100% agree with Mrs. Wood here. And, I, I made a video on this, um, a two part video, and I think they both got less than 300 views. I think one got 300, the other one got like 180 or 200 views. It was like a back to back video I made covering this news. And again, it just shows, you know, we're so early in this space, guys. We're so early. And, you know, we're, this is this is the time to invest, in my opinion, not financial advice, but when markets are down, you know, we're in a recession. It's pretty, pretty bear market for the last year. In biotech, it's been a bear market for like one, almost two years at this point. Um, so lots of thing going on here. I'll end this video like this, guys. I don't want to extend this video too much. Sorry, really late as you can see. And as you can tell from my, me lowering my voice, I don't want to disturb my neighbors. Uh, of course, I am back in Toronto officially for the first time in over three weeks. It's been almost a month I was away from Toronto. So uh, it's... Time to get back to the groove, right? Time to get back to the routine. So thank you so much for watching, guys. As always, like this video if you found value. Subscribe if not. And let me know in the comments below, what do you think we go from here? You know, what do you think happens from here, right? With Elon Musk giving exposure to this news. It's amazing news. It should have this much exposure. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.